Sitefire FDS is an application created to perform dynamic fire simulations in buildings using the FDS analysis engine developed by NIST. The program allows both the evaluation of fire safety of buildings during the design phase and the reconstruction of fire scenarios, making it of great use to the technicians responsible for the design of extinguishing, temperature control and smoke evacuation systems, as well as for the training of fire brigades. To get started, we can import the geometric model of a project hosted on the BIM Server Center platform that provides a collaborative workflow via Open BIM technology. Then, we review the data of the BIM model, including the building elements, openings and sprinklers that have been automatically created in the import process. We then export this information to the FDS model, with which we configure the characteristics of the fire simulation, carry out the analysis and access the results obtained after the simulation. Using a library system, we define the properties of gaseous species, materials and services of elements, enter Lagrangian particles, indicate the behaviour of the combustion reaction, and define devices such as heat and smoke detectors, thermocouples, sprinklers and nozzles. Next, we configure the FDS model by specifying the analysis meshes, the pressure zones, the initial regions, the obstructions that form the geometry of the model, the vents at the mesh boundary, the devices and their controls, and the slices that allow us to view the results. Once the model description is finished, we launch the analysis to perform the simulation using the integrated FDS analysis engine. Once completed, we can use the Smoke View Viewer, a tool also developed by NIST, which allows us to view the results of the dynamic fire simulation in a 3D environment, such as the distribution and evolution of temperatures, airspeed and degree of visibility. Also, the smoke and fire generated during the fire can be represented in the viewer. This way, we can evaluate how the building will perform in the event of a fire and the adequacy of its smoke evacuation and temperature control systems. Finally, to check the results, we can also view graphs over time, with the evolution of the different parameters measured in the simulation, as well as check the performance of the devices and controls entered in the model.